Hello guys, this is Jaitri from Press Media and welcome to the end of the episode of Flutter App Development Tutorial. In the last episode, we just created a Hello World application which was written inside the main method. In this episode, I am going to show you how you can use object-oriented method to do the same work along with some more we get. So this one is my working directory and I am using the Visual Studio code. So open with Visual Studio code and let's close the welcome screen. I am going to use the command to create a new application for Flutter create a material app. Flutter is uh, creating a new app, material app. Uh, it will take a little bit time. We're saying all done, and we just need to wait a few more seconds. All right, it's done. So let's change the directory so that we can run the command later. And as usual, we are going to work on main dot dot file just minimize it and remove all of the code so i'm going to import package and flutter slash material dot dart let's uh, declare the main method void main and inside the main method we will use a run app which is blank for this moment because we are going to use the uh, class method here we will leave it as it is when we will declare a class uh, we will create a new object and place here so I am going to use class my app extends uh, stateless we get okay so we have declared our class and we can see there is some error in my app uh, if we mouse over there then we can see a get one message okay uh, we can call the override method and in return we are going to use the same widgets which we used yesterday that was text widget to test the application text and hello flutter so obviously text widget have the uh, text direction and text direction LTR it means left to right and we can create an object for my app it's ready to run and we can use the run command flutter run okay so we we don't have any emulator and device uh, for for testing we can go to the debug and start debugging or press f5 key so uh, visual studio code also provide us the installed emulators so in my machine you can see the pixel and it's run from the okay we have some problem with gpu uh, my pc is giving me some error and there may be my driver is not working well so it's installing and okay our app is running and it's not uh, uh, looking so good so uh, we need to add some more widgets uh, like yesterday we used the center widget and we can use the same widget here also so just remove this comment and 
at the center and center always have a child so first let me uh, close this one and remove this termination and add the child element and just save the application and let it run in emulator so flutter i have the hot reload so you don't need to uh, run the code again and again uh, just save the code and it will work so let's add some more we get here so we have a style for the uh, text we get and text style is so let's add the text color colors sorry colors dot white and the font size is a 30 and save it let's check it in the emulator it's working well and for further i'm going to use the metal app for this uh, application so here uh, return new material app and in the material app we have a widget that is title and let's give title welcome to flutter so there is another uh, widget home and we can use new material here in material we have color and color start green uh, which will provide the background color for the app and inside the child we can place all of this center code just cut it and paste here remove the termination and add to material app and save the app so everything perfectly working here uh, you may think that uh, where is the title is uh, going so if you resize the app you can see the title here this is the title so for the app title we will use some other widget so that's all for this tutorial thank you guys thank you for watching me i hope you understand some more about the class method in a flutter tutorial thank you for watching me have a nice day